will Rick confront Shane about the whole Lori situation? Is Herschel going to allow them to stay on the farm? And we still got all these walkers in the barn getting fed chickens. That's what's on my mind as we go into season two, episode seven of The Walking Dead. What's up, guys? If you're new here, this is NMD Movies. I'm your host, Grant, and we watch movies and TV shows for the very first time. If you want to see the full reactions to these type of videos, also get these videos earlier and other exclusive content, then check your boy out on Patreon. And if you already signed up with the Patreon, I appreciate you more than you know. But this season is getting better and better. And poor Rick, I feel like he's going through a lot. Now he knows Lori's pregnant. Now he knows about Shane. Now what will he do? Let's find out. Season two, episode seven of The Walking Dead. Let's get it. Let him know, Glenn. Guys. Yes, Glenn. Barn's full of walkers. Ah! Look at everybody. And that got y'all attention, didn't it? <laughs> Boy. You cannot tell me you're all right with this. No, I'm not. But we're guests here. This isn't our land. Oh, we just gotta go now. We have been talking about Fort Benning for we a long can't time now. Go. Why, Rick? Why? Why, Rick? Because my daughter's still out there. Oh, uh, here we go. I'm close to finding this girl. I just found a damn doll two days ago. <laughs> you found her doll, Daryl. That's what you did. You found a doll. You know what the hell you're talking Ooh! Buck knife, you geek ears around your neck. She would run in the other direction, Shut man. Up. Now, I uh, see, see, see. Now, that's what Merle's talking about when you say stuff like that, Shane. Hey, I'll beat right you right out, Back off. Keep your hands off me. Ooh. The man is crazy, Rick. If Herschel thinks those things are like me. Yeah, that man also saved Carl's life. A lot is going on. And the first thing is, Rick, did you see the way Shane said, don't put your hands on me? Because look, if it was me and you said that to my wife, knowing what I already know, I probably would have broke your jaw. I'm just saying that. Would have broke the jaw uppercut right there. But I think it's a little overreaction. Yes, he has walkers in the barn. None of these walkers have gotten out. Let's calm down and think about this. This isn't our land. This is Herschel's land. And like I said, there hasn't even been a scare. So let's not just assume the worst. Had nobody ever told y'all y'all would be sleeping peacefully, not even worried about the barn. Now you're screaming, yelling, you're getting them riled up, and you're about to go mess with them. Leave them alone. And let Rick talk to Herschel about it. And if I was Herschel, I'll say, look, if you don't like my rules, get out. I've already saved your son. You're running through my medical supplies. Your friend is having sexual intercourse with my daughter. You're giving me the heebie-jeebies. Get off my land. Or put an egg on your head. Why would you waste an egg like that? I think it was rotten. My thing is you told him to be a leader, right? To me, that's being the leader, informing your troops of something like this. It would have been selfish of him to keep that to himself for as long as he did. Now, you can't have it both ways. You can't tell him to be a leader within his group and, and to use his intellect and then, tell, and then want him to only do what you want him to do, Maggie. I'm not leaving until we find Sophia. Mm. I don't want to go even after that. Oh, man. Oh, we're not leaving, Carl. We're not leaving, Carl. We're finish those problems. This place it could be a home. Y'all got to go to Fort Benny. Y'all got to go to Fort Benny. Um, Sophia's probably dead, but if I'm Durrell and I've risked my life and I and I finally found the doll, I want to keep look at, looking after her. If I'm Curl, I want to keep looking after him. It's just a tough choice for anybody to make, honestly. We don't know if we're going to find her, Daryl. Can't lose you, too. So let me be. Stupid bitch. That's his way of saying he loves you and he cares about you. He don't want to get too close. That's that's all that is. That's all that is. You know. In the meantime, Shane wants a, a watch duty down there. Is Rick? Why wouldn't he? 
Mm. Is that how you want to be? Like him? He's not a victim. You don't know him. I'm okay, really. Things are... different. Yeah. She a grown woman, Dale. Let her, let her do her thing. She grown. You got your gun. I think you, you told her how you felt. Now you got to let her make her decisions at the end of the day. And this is coming from somebody who's not a big Andrea fan. You mind running and getting me some water? Yeah. Sure. What is Dale about to do? He about to do something. Luke 8. My man Herschel just want to read his Bible, eat his peaches, and leave his walkers in the barn. Y'all don't disturb his peace. I'm telling you. I'm with you, Herschel. Don't disturb my peace. We found the barn. Barn, your farm, your say. I don't want to talk about the barn. I don't want to debate. I need you and your group gone by the end of the week. Whoa, you heard the man. Get the hell out of here. They may be dead, they may be alive, but my people, us, we are alive. You send us out there and that could change. I've given you safe harbor. Mm. My conscience is clear. Mm. Dale said you saw everything happen on the news. Well, it's been, it's been a long time since the camera stopped rolling. What part of I don't want to debate? You say he don't want to debate. Do not send us out there again. Hmm. My wife's pregnant. Oh, Lord. That's either a gift here or a death sentence out there. Oh, think about it. I thought about it. Think about it again. We can't go out there. Oh, my God. Is, is, is Rick going to kill Herschel? Shane going to kill Herschel? Oh, man. Okay. It would be, how can you throw out somebody that's pregnant? But also, you got to realize all the trouble that they have brought on this man land. I've already talked about it. You brought a maniac on his farm. You got another guy who's having sex with his daughter. You're up and down. You don't know what you want, what you don't want. It's a tough decision. Punch his ass, Rick. Clyde's taken, Rick. No, 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 it isn't, Shane. That barn, the barn's secure. Dang. Look, if we're not gonna go in there and clear it out, then we just gotta go. We're not That's gonna clear it out, and we're not gonna go. We just need our guns. We, we, we can't that. have them. We not here. Guns. Shane, you... We can make, how are we gonna do that? We will, okay? How are we gonna we make will. it safe, okay. Rick? No, man, it's not okay, Rick. Okay. Lori's pregnant. We need our guns. No, you know what? Yes, we... I can work this out. Tori's having a baby, man. Congratulations. Mm. Thank you. Boy, boy. He really about to turn up now. Here's my thing with Shane, because I understand the people who say, Shane is about survival, about Lori and Carl, about doing the, the tough decisions. But right now, he's just doing everything to spite Rick. If Rick says go right, he's going to bring up why we can't go left. Rick says go up, he's going to wonder why we can't go down. And I got to tell you, if you're a leader, that's the worst type of person to have in your group. Just uh, micromanaging, whining, and crying and all this stuff. How are they my responsibility? A new command I give to you. Woo! Love one another as I have loved you. Mm. I love you. That's part of this. Mm-hmm. He doing it for you. Is this about you and the Asian boy? Do you want no, him to? No. The man's name is Glenn, damn it. His name is Glenn. You saved my life yesterday when one of the people you think is sick tried to kill me. Mm, his head was dangling. Things aren't what you think they are. They aren't. Don't do this. 
It's about you. It's about who you are, who you're gonna be. Man. It happened again. What happened now? All right, guys, let me know in the comments. If you were Herschel, would you allow them to stay on the farm? But I just need Rick. He said it happened again. So what happened? I thought he was dead. Shame. And then, uh, I don't. And then when you... I wished he was. <laughs> not, not, not because you wouldn't be mine, but because I knew that sooner or later he would be dead. He ain't built for this world. Hmm. You're wrong. Well, how many times has he saved your life? See, by my account, I've saved your life on four different occasions, and that's... Damn, we, we, we keep it score now? We, we keep it score? That night what, at the what, camp no, after no, the no, fish no, fry. No, 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 no. That was me, too. He showed up late because he went on a, a suicide mission over nothing. And so we lost Amy, and we lost Jim. We lost... Nah, I don't like this. I don't like this. I don't rock with this. Nope. I do not condone it. Rick told me. Told you what? I know the reason why you didn't. It's because you know it's mine. Before Rick got back, Laura, it's mine. You know it is. You're you know wrong. It's... You're wrong. I'm sorry. Shane, I'm sorry. But even if it's yours, it's not going to be. Ooh! That's a bar. That's a bar. Even if it is yours, it ain't going to be yours. I don't need to. Even if it is yours, it's never going to be yours. He about to go crazy. I'm going to let y'all know right now. I thought Shane was crazy, but he really about to do some diabolical stuff. Look at him. Oh, man. Oh, man. Hey, Shane. Oh. <gasps> Uh, don't be mean to him. Okay, he loved Carl. He loved Carl. I know you think Sophia's dead, and that we should stop looking for her. Bullshit. Hey, man, watch your mouth. We're going to stay here until we find her. Mm. Then we stay. That means we got to do whatever we got to do to make that happen. Hmm? Like help out the chores? Mm. Mm. Shane gonna try to kill Herschel. I'm calling it right now. Carl? I'm gonna hear you talk like that again. Mm. For a second there, I thought he was gonna be mean to Carl, but Shane loves Carl. He loves Carl. So, he, he ain't gonna, but look at him. Look back in that face again. Dale took the guns. Dale took the guns. Dale took the guns. Dale took the guns. You can look for the guns, but Dale took the guns. Look for the guns, but Dale took the guns. 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 But if you and your people are going to stay here, that's how you're going to have to treat them. Mm. My farm, my barn, my say. Mm. But he told us to get him into the barn. Now we have to. What happens when the barn gets full? Oh, my goodness. Jimmy ain't ready for this. Jimmy ain't ready for this. Easy, easy, Rick. Lead it. Jimmy will spot for us. Pull him. Lead it. It's easier than something. And see, it. and if I was Rick, it would be hard for me not to take out these walkers. You know, you're about to have a newborn sleeping every night. And then, you know, it's going to be crying. You got a a, 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 a a barn full of walkers. I don't know, man. This just don't seem good. Did not. No, I did. Hmm. Okay, I wanted to. Hmm. Put that fruit down, girl. I love you. See, you. I forgot. I don't care if they're sick people or dead people. They're dangerous. Mm, good point. Good point. And then I realized something else. That I don't want you in danger ever. I don't want to lose you, girl. And I'd rather have you pissed off at me and alive mm. than liking me and dead. Mm. So that's why I told him. Huh. Then you gotta walk away from her. You gotta walk away from her. Hey, Walker Bait. Don't call me that. 
Like she gonna really let you now, Glenn. Like watch this. Look at that smile. Yeah, what she loved that. Huh? You had to tell her. You had to tell her what was up. Then you gotta walk away. Sometimes you gotta be able to walk away to let them know you won't be walked on. You know what I'm saying? Kissing you all in front of the house and everything. My boy Glenn said, I'm willing to walk away. And hey, she didn't wanna lose you. So what's Dale playing with the guns? Oh Lord. Good hiding place. We ain't been in the swamps much, huh? What, are you gonna shoot me like you did, Otis? Tell another story. Huh? Make another story? Man, you pretty much dead already. Damn. Just give me the guns. He's trying to get Herschel to let Dale, us. Dale, shut up. Just shut up and give me the guns. Dale, give him the guns. He'll kill an old man in a second. I'm gonna have to shoot you. Hold on now. I have to kill you? Is that what it's gonna take? <laughs> He about to attack him. He about to attack him. Damn, Dale. You ain't about that life, Dale. You can't take a life. That's what's going to take. Yeah, Dale, he's got too much of a heart. He ain't going to shoot him. This is where you belong. And I, I may not have what it takes to last for long, but that's okay. Mm. At least I can say, what in the world Goes to shit. I didn't let it take me down with it. Preach it, brother. Preach it, brother. Fair enough. Like, you think you the man because you bullied the old man, Shane? Dale, you did what you had to because he was going to take you out, man. He was going to take you out. With me, man. Yeah. Time to grow up. He's on his way. Oh, we couldn't care. Yeah, well, we can and we have to. Oh, man. How about you, man? You gonna protect yours? Can you shoot? Can you stop? If you do this, you hand out these guns, my dad will make you leave tonight. Going anywhere, okay? Now look, Herschel, he's just gonna understand, okay? He. No. What the hell is he trying to do? Huh? I want you to take this. You take it, Carl, and you keep your mother safe. You do whatever. Daryl, do something, man. Do something, Daryl. <laughs> I've seen that meme I, where Shane takes off running. I've seen that meme on Twitter so many times. Now I finally know what it means. <laughs> what the hell are you doing? She just found uh, off. Why do your people have guns? Are you kidding me? I see who I'm holding on nah, to. Nah, man, you don't. Just let us do this. That we can Shane, calm your ass down. They're dead. Hey. Ain't got to feel nothing for them because all they do, they kill. These things right here. They're the things that killed Amy. They killed Otis. Shut up. Hey, Herschel, man, let me ask you something. Did a living, breathing person, did they walk away from this? No. This one. Three rounds in the chest. Could someone who's alive, could they just take that? Why is it still coming? <laughs> Hey, he, he making a he making a good point. I don't like the delivery, but but he is making a good point. That is enough. That's messed up. I mean, it's he looks at it as a person, so it's messed up to me. If somebody's looking at something like a person, then you can't just shoot it in front of them. Enough, risking our lives for a little girl who's gone. Enough. I told y'all he was going to go crazy. Now, if y'all want to live, if you want to survive, you got to fight for it. I'm talking about fight. Take the snare. This man shaded Marshall, lost his mind. Marshall, he over here giving some kind of a weird-ass motivational speech. Herschel, we need you to get up. Stop. Take it. He about to let all the walkers out? Do not do this, brother. Come on. There's no going back from this. There is no going back for this. Get behind me. Come on. 
Look at all of Herschel's family members. Cousin Ted. Look at Andrea running up. I mean, you gotta kill them now because they go kill you. I mean, you had to do what you had to do. You basically killing his family in front of him. That's kind of how I look at it. But once you open the bar, you got to let him out. I mean, Herschel go, Herschel go kick y'all out. Y'all got to get the hell off the bar now. In front of Herschel, in front of kids, making a scene like this. I mean, you think Jimmy is going to be uh, safe around y'all? You think the, the other people are, are going to feel safe with a crazy man running around screaming? You got to fight for it. You got to fight for it. Is Sophia... She was in the barn the whole time. <laughs> oh my goodness. Damn, somebody's gotta, somebody's gotta. Wow. 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 Somebody in my comments, they said some people don't like season two because it's slow or something like that. I'm paraphrasing, but I don't see how anybody couldn't like this season because the emotions I just felt during that whole scene. The emotions that you got Shane going crazy. I'm like, what is he doing? You got him killing walkers. You got him handing out guns. You got him looking like a maniac. And, and, and my my energy, my, oh, my God, I'm like, oh, whoa, 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 whoa. I'm, I'm just going crazy. Then you see him taking out the walkers, and I'm like, well, look, if the walkers are coming at you, then you got to take them out. Then I feel bad for Maggie, who's crying, for Herschel, who's out of it, because their family members are getting killed right in front of their eyes. They're already dead. But to see them getting shot is different then. I'm thinking that's it. I'm thinking, I, I honestly thought maybe Rick was going to go over there and just knock Shane out or something. I don't know. But Sophia walks out and I'm instantly, so many emotions go through. I don't even know what to say. I'm sad that Sophia's dead. Um, 
I'm like, damn, in my mind, I'm saying, was Shane right? Does this make everything that Shane just did, does this make Shane right? Rick, how do you feel about this? Uh, uh, Daryl? Um, Curl? She's balling. I'm sad for her. And then Rick has to take him out. I'm about to watch the next episode, but I need to take a water break. Here's what I'm going to ask. Did Herschel know that she was in there? Did Maggie know she was in there? Because that changes the game. So everything Shane just did, going crazy, taking the guns, screaming, giving these motivationals, hey, this is what I want to know. If you're going to fight, you're going to have to fight. Who's going to fight? You get a gun. You get a gun. All that craziness. I'm like, this dude is a villain. This dude is horrible. This dude is terrible. Only to find out that he was right all alone. And not only was it they needed to get into that barn, but Sophia's there so now they can stop looking. So was Shane right? Y'all got to let me know in the comments. And then, Rick. Boy, 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 Rick, 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 Rick. I know you going through it, dog. Because she was right in that barn the whole time. You got maps, grids, color-coded signals and signs. And she was right there the whole time. R.I.P. Sophia, man.